of course. Howdy, folks. Got my new welder here. Me and Dalton just got done buying. We got this <laughs> nice welding mask right here that came with it. I hope nobody uses this. We might try to hit a little thing with it. I don't know. But we did get a helmet right here. This is our Chicago Electric 125 uh, welder from Harbor Freight. Uh, this is your normal run-of-the-mill stick, you know, wire fed motor. So we're going to try to learn it. We're going to do some uh, quick things. Just try to learn for the first time how to weld. So that's good. We have the old same company welding helmet that is not auto dimming. It is the El Cheapo helmet along with the welding. Right here. Should do us fine. Right there. So to start with, we got some metals here that we're gonna mess with. Don't know what even they're made out of. But we got this little piece of bracket here. I done sanded it to get nice metal. We have a license plate. We're gonna try to weld that to there. And then whatever the heck this is, we might uh, try to get on there too. <laughs> we're gonna experiment with some uh, wire speed, the uh, voltage, and we'll see what we can get going. But. Uh, I guess first we're gonna try to tack that old piece of bracketry to the uh, license plate. So we got all Dalton here. He's welded before, so he's gonna show me a little bit on what to do, if he can remember. Been about two and a half years. But we do have this clamped onto this little brick here so that our part will stay in place. We're gonna tack it real quick, right here where we got it sanded. Uh, we got our ground connected. We're going to go ahead and flip on the welder. I'm gonna leave that on a just medium speed for right now. We'll try to mess with it. But yeah. That wire is not, I don't know if it's not grounded good. Maybe I'm yeah, we'll get it. You want me to change some of the settings? Yeah, we're gonna mess around with the settings because we will have to find a good setting for the metal that we're working with. Bukas just came on his lunch break real quick from work because he heard we were welding. Dedicated bully time. <laughs> we're gonna turn you on here. We're on a- We're also trying to weld aluminum to steel because they are, bleep this word out, retards. <laughs> um, It'll work. Turn your wire speed up. Beat up. Turn your wire speed up. Well, there's the cutter if you want to cut the end off. Oh, just turn it up a little bit. Let's see what he got. Do you have a brush? <laughs> I love <laughs> super dirty and it's not making a connection. Yeah, I about told you that. Do it right there. It's painted. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll sand it real quick. High quality, Devin. You are low quality, that's it, the problem. It did not arc. What are you trying to do? I'm what is the voltage rusty. set at? Minimum, I'll put it on maximum. Put it on max. <laughs> put it on max. Let's see what we got. She ain't pretty, but. It's also not going to be structural, which is great because you're welding steel to a limit. <laughs> not too bad. I mean, exactly what I thought would happen from flux core. But yeah, not too bad. As you my turn mentor once said, that looks like uh, chicken crap. <laughs> you need to turn your wire speed up a little more. Right. Super slow. We're going to experiment with it, but. Right. So I'm going for my first weld ever. I'm going to. Go ahead and get this. We got it all clamped down. I got my spot right there. I'm going to be welding a piece of steel to a lawnmower blade. That's pretty cool. Get our helmet. We're going to get plugged up. Alright, Well, I 
That is my first well. Let's <laughs> give her a look. It's a little big. But I think I welded it to it. Yeah, you got a little tack there. Well, I want to see if it actually stuck to it. Turn her off. So that is my first ever time welding something to anything. Now I'll give it a little hit across the table. See <laughs> give it a little hit across the table, see if it comes off. That's not bad. Honestly, I thought it would fall off immediately. I actually got it tacked on there. Sweet. I guess now I'm going to try to do a little bit of a beat across there. I ain't never done that, so we're going to see what we can do. We'll get this clamp back down. Bad. It definitely wasn't straight because I'm still getting used to how these uh, helmets work. Yeah. But I mean, it's across there. I didn't go in a straight line. It's kind of zigzag. But, you know. Go ahead and turn the welder off. I'm not going to cry about it because it's called learning. Alright. So that is Debo's first weld. What do you think? Not terrible. Not good. Not, not good. You know. But we're definitely going to have to get us like a flap wheel or something to uh, clean up the spatter and junk on it since, you know, it's just the type of welder it is. But here, we'll use the tool loop. Told us to use. Whoa! So much cleaner. Bead number two, we're gonna weld it on the back side so it's nice and strong. How's she looking? Hey, I will say for a second in that center spot, that was actually decent. Right. That's not that bad in the middle. Second dime wedding, baby. Okay, we cleaned it up with the uh, brush. And I will say, right there, for a second, that is a bead. I was able to get going. Starting and ending, I kind of suck. But I think whatever I was doing right there, if I could keep that speed, we might have something. Mighty nice. All right, well, Dalton's going to try to weld whatever the heck this is somewhere on here either that or on the other end of the bl the blade there but we're gonna fix it up well then that's pretty good yeah. that is literally just like a looks like a log laid it right there on the table laid a turd straight across there let's clean that up i tell you what that ain't half bad i don't know how our contact is right there but for what it is it looks pretty good right. good bead maybe not such a great location <laughs> we're gonna do the strength test real quick Wait. hold on <laughs> What? It's just smaller. <laughs> you literally laid a bead onto this part. It was a mighty nice bead, though, I tell you what. That's not bad. Did it even do anything right here? Just spatter? Yeah. yeah. That wasn't great. But, I mean, it welded to this, though. That's not bad. Good, it's a bead. Now I'm going to try to perfect it. I'm going to try to fix mine over here on the other side. Why is your head so big? I just got big head. Why your head so small? <laughs> All right, so here we go. Looking any better over? Not <laughs> necessarily. I feel like you just made your two lumps bigger. <laughs> Didn't even join them together. <laughs> We'll 
so I just did a test run. That's much better, I will say. Yeah. <laughs> that, that is a lot better. better. But that is on flat metal as yeah. well. Yeah. I thought I would go ahead and do one right there on the flat just because that'll help me get my speed down because instead of trying to follow that crack and everything, I'm going to clean it up real quick. How's she look? Looking pretty good. Not bad, honestly. Not bad. I can I actually see, had see a, little rounds. You had a little hiccup there in the middle. Yeah, kind of. Looks but bad, not bad. But yeah, it's not too bad. So we're going to go for a angle weld right here on these two pieces right here. You want to come look at that? We got a nice little 90 degree here with a gap, and I'm going to attempt to weld that close. We got all types of junk on the end of our gun. All right. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, not great. Got a little few strands. Yeah. Touching. There it is, cleaned up. Any better? It's all right. Just not doing much connecting. Yeah. I'll uh, run another one across the bottom just to see. Let's see if we can knock some junk off.